I should have hit him there, but I think the attack speed is too slow, so actually, like, you need to pre-aim it, more or less, lead the attack. where they are so let's just finish up the battle like most of the an armies like low tier troops what about theirs uh, so is theirs well, uh, imperial equities 48 that's near camp imperial cat frags 30 uh, I don't think we can win a battle versus uh, are we actually going to be able to catch him Oh my god, really? Uh, I don't think the ba battles are winnable yet. The enemy outnumber us by so much. Right, they did have a f uh, bridge battle, but we could actually cross. Yeah, this one's crossable as well. That's how it's done. Shield won't save you from headshot, man. Maybe it will. Much you want to fight? Come on. I do need a... One of the weapons has like super long range and it's super fast. I can't remember what it's called. Which one exactly it is. In the interior, all the Japanese weapons are not, shouldn't be costing a lot to actually to make since, you know, welding steel, but low quality steel, all that shit. I guess we can let them go. We kill the uh, we kill the leaders, and one of them escaped, of course. Okay, now let's run away. Yeah, there's. I mean, look at that. That's going not going too well. Well, if this guy joined him and I joined him, it could. Uh, oh, never mind. These are mercenaries. They're not that good. Increase your party side. Why is this in fucking archery or bow? Increase mounted arch accuracy. Yes, mounted archery. Why is this here? Some of these perk placements make no freaking sense, man. The party consumes 10% less food. Party wages are 5% less. Increase your damage with two handed axes. No, we're going. Well, I hope they count as swords. I'm not sure, to be honest. Yeah. Count as a sword. I 
I would use this, but... Hmm. Doesn't do that much damage, to be honest. I do want to get the handle of the Yari as well. So we can actually hit stuff with it. Let's put this back up to like 50%. Do you have an idea to get the armors from these guys? We do need to... Wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna make it so we can actually loot heroes and allies and old dead for a couple of missions. Now let's turn that off. Otherwise, I don't think we're going to get most of the weapons unless I actually make a specific companion for smithing, which I don't really want to do, to be honest. Mm, takes too much effort. I don't want to, like, sit there blacksmithing. I want to fight. Well, those guys got, got wrecked. Um, well, thanks. Chill. The wait. Peanut Chill. That's a good name. Let's see. Yeah, I didn't hit, like, hit level clan level two. I don't think, but we should be close. I just needed to hunt down more enemy lords to kill them. I don't think the AI by itself is gonna do anything smart when it comes to taking land. So I'm gonna need to do it myself at some point. Okay, let's check the Empire again. They didn't lose anything this time around. It means we're not as lucky. Unfortunately. Although I would like... Oh, right. I was thinking of... Uh, looking uh, to see if the culture change mod works. So I forgot about it. I'm gonna do it after the stream. It would be nice because... Um, we don't have a lot of the recruiting area, otherwise it would be great if we can actually like convert these to the Tessagen culture. We can get our troops over there. Oh, I'm not, not exactly sure it's, if it's going to work because, it's, you know, it's not a vanilla culture. We'll see what happens. I was using with the, it with the uh, Eagle Rising mod, the culture switched back to the Empire base culture, not the, you know, Roman one. So that's an issue. See here. Inventory. Okay, everything's fine. Let's go back in, I guess. We were in a couple, a couple of battles as well last time, if I remember correctly. This area is so freaking annoying to navigate. You can get caught anywhere. Like, there's like. Like, look at this. You can go through here. To here. Oh my god. I have to be a little bit more careful while I'm roaming around this area. The troop composition, like, as well. Many of these guys. Uh, everything else is uh, kind of. Mm, well, half of these are decent. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Ah, uh, he's gonna run into the castle. Okay, well, let's see. Should be able to catch him. And we pull the other guy in as well. Good. Oh, it's a bridge battle. Uh, but they can't cross the water here, right? Yeah, it's pretty shallow. Right. Most of my troops are skirmish cav. Move! Move! 
Take order! Sergeants, go! So ideally they're gonna come to us, but uh, this guy is just gonna charge in. Seems like it. We need to take out their calories, that's for sure. It'll be easy now, they're only like uh, 15 of them. They're gonna stay there. Let's go quickly cross the bridge. Because that would be the smart thing to do, right? Not through the water, though. No. Oh, yeah. I still don't... I still didn't get the... All the timing and the reach of this, right? He says as he has shots. This guy ain't gonna turn around, he's gonna be pretty slow in the water. Oh my god, what a mess. We still didn't get the cross. Okay, look at that. I actually got the lance off. Nice. Run, 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 run. I'm actually surprised that we are not getting hit by the arrows. You know. I got hit more when I had a shield with me than now. Okay, he wasn't close enough there. my guys up here looks like the AI has the right idea you shoot him first before we charge in Our guys are not half bad. Although having a full army of them might actually work out better for this until he starts sieging the castles down. Even then, actually, they actually have a shield, so they might do well than the other infantry we got. I have, or whatever the, the, it's called.
Oh, that's an enemy. Not anymore. That blind? Probably I am. Oh, never mind, they're not there. They're somewhere over there retreating. Yep, I see a purple shield. what we want to do so we can actually get uh, some of the better testogen armor there we go an upgrade already and some of the better weapons for them as well because otherwise we would need to craft them i don't want to do i don't want to sit there craft shit for hours and hours Infantry. Let's go with a couple more swordsmen, I guess. All right, we can go sell off the stuff in the, at the nearest town. And now we ain't gonna catch him no way. actually as for food we're fine and I do want to kill those 63 looters hopefully without taking losses okay so let's try and do this just Set the uh, like mounted archers behind the archers and just ban them like that. Might be a better idea than letting them skirmish. Could they spawn a little further fucking back? And since when the looter starts with Cav? Oh, it's four marauders, never mind. It's not gonna work out too that well.
Yeah, this might be a better idea. Just in the beginning until the enemy come close enough to us. Doesn't matter that much. We're not gonna be taking them. Do look. Oh, this might. This army might be able to actually do something. Hopefully, unless they disband, like as as they get over there, because that is a problem a little bit. Do sometimes see the AI actually use or increase their cohesion, like the lords use that ability, as you can. Very often, though. I'm gonna go with like no set noble troops to skirmish for AI. Rest of them on foot. That's gonna be the idea from now on. They got enough cohesion, I think. And if you do get in a big battle, there's going to be a lot of loot from friendlies. So you might be able to get all the fancy stuff from the uh, mod as well. Before cut. I'll try keeping that on us for the for the field battles. Hmm. And now I did see the AI actually like try and build trebuchets and all that. Um, let's see what happens now. Okay, never mind. We uh, actually, that battering ram might actually survive to the walls. Let's switch that out. And the wide arrows. Yeah, that battering ram should be able to get to the walls if, if they only have one uh, catapult on them. Get off the horse, we're not an easy target. What? Did the guy fall off? Yes, he did. Wanna get up the, on the oh god. Right, sieges are fixed. Uh, 
We want to get up on the walls, though. The betting ram is never gonna come up here. Good thing I went for one for this uh, this side. The catapult's on there. What's up, Rufus? I don't think I'm gonna be able to get a hit on those guys, so let's get up the ladders. I like the fact that there's a whole lot of pe peasants coming up with on the oh yeah. And I'm getting shot as well from the like below. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh oh yeah. He's actually doing something smart. Look at that. A bunch of watchers waiting. Yeah. Look. Oh shit. We're gonna lose a shitload of troops on this battle. That's why you always break the walls down, so shit like this doesn't happen. The troops get on the walls, and they get shot from the... Can they get shot? Yes, they can. Plus the siege, uh, sieges are still bugged as hell. Where the fuck is he going? Or they? Yeah, look at the losses and this is a normal difficulty. Uh, well, like the second hardest difficulty as well. Should fare better in the, fare better in the melee though. Kind of. Maybe not, because these peasants only have the Yaris, not the Katanas, actually. Well, this is worse than I fucking thought. Look at the... Yeah, our guys are getting shot as they come. Yeah, they're not even getting off the ladders as they die before the, the, Before that. These guys have a clear shot on them as well. I mean, we are gonna overwhelm them with numbers at the end, but look at the losses, Jesus Christ. actually need to like starve the enemy out of the city that might be a better idea and actually fighting the battle we still need to see how the like higher tier infantry and soldiers fare against the enemies and I'll decide what we're gonna do or how we're gonna see shit Most of the kills are from the enemy archers to be expected. We need a steward. 
So let's go with stewardship, medicine, and leadership. Why not? Still do need an engineer. Keep all the loot. Part dead, yes. Okay, this is what we wanted. Oh no. This is not what we wanted. No freaking way I'm gonna have that on my back again. Oh yeah, we might need we might need that. I like the fact that it looks like uh Yeah, let's stick with that, even though it's not that uh, high in defense or armor. Arden Diari. What the fuck's the difference? Let me check. Ooh, two more damage, I guess. Let's see what else. Niñato, right? So this is this a better sword? Let's check. And again, this is supposed to be a katana. One damage. Yeah, this one does a lot more cut. Mm. Let's stick with the katana. For now. sure about which bow do we use. I mean, the speed would be nice, but this is even considered better, like the 10, 10 more piercing damage. I think that's too good to give up. We can use shurikens though. Anyways, let's grab all this. I do need to get this guy the right shit. Quartermaster, Quartermaster. Okay, all troops daily experience. There is food consumption. This discarded armor can be donated. Don't pay wages for wounded soldiers. Inclusive influence gained from donating, donating troops. Oh, aid corps. Right now, having diverse food is double. Can't upgrade. Cost of upgrading units is ten percent less. Um, I think we still need the food one. Two troops' wages are. Costs are decreased? No. Prisoners in your party provide carry capacity. I think the construction speed. I think that works for uh, like siege engines and that stuff. I'm not sure. Something just carrying capacity for troops. Trade penalty? No. Pack animals, that's for sure. All this other stuff, I'm gonna let the game pick. 
equip this. Thanks, Arthas. Glad you like him. Hope you, you guys are doing well over there. From all the uh, sanctions and all that bullshit. So all this. Look at the money, man. We can check. I'm not gonna sell everything here. Let's see. Okay, so selling all the weapons, we get the uh, more money than they had actually have. Okay, so now okay, they're, still, they're just running back to the capital, I think. So let's. Uh, I guess I can help this guy along the way. Why not? Stop the cooked. Yes, I do. So I think this is a mercenary army, so they're gonna have a ton of a. Uh, you know, well, not a ton of. Well, more skirmishers than we do, that's for sure. To Time to get shot. Literally. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna auto resolve this then. No, this is not uh, our own faction. This is a modded faction in the game. Oh, nice. These look a little bit better. It's in the in the title. This is the Tetsujin, Tetsujin mod. Kerbo. Oh, I'm not sure what the like the best bows in the game are like actually, since I never use them. I'm gonna grab all this stuff anyway. I did join the Tetsujin faction though. I don't think I'm gonna be creating my own because. Um, we're gonna have enough problems beating the Empire. Considering it's united and all that. Good that the guy didn't kill for me. Nice. Okay, we hit clan level two. No, not yet. The, uh, the the guy we picked up actually is bringing that much art capacity. Let's recruit those guys as well. 5k. 31. 99. So these... Let me check if there's any, actually anything good here. Annabelle, no. Naginata, Nagamaki. So th this is a polar arm as well. Let's pick it up, we'll see what it's like. Sparta, no. Look at the cost of it as well. 137k. Cannot be used while, while mounted though. Got none of that for me. See about the armors.
I think this is the shit we sold them. Hmm. Can actually get the black armor as well. Nice. Roller plates? Nope. But we got a decent upgrade. Maneuver. Mm, I think we're still gonna stick with the faster horse. We can actually catch up to the enemies. Okay, now I can actually fight battles with like a higher tier enemies as well, so we can, you know, so we can get more loot. And why did I tag this one? Right, they have some elite units on them. The fact that there is like they use the same weapon on every tier, man. <laughs> Let's grab all these and we're gonna let go some of, yeah, get rid of some recruits. Okay, now we're gonna stay archer. Okay, so cannibal, which ones do we do these? Yeah, Naginatas. Um, these turn into Nagamakis. Okay, I don't know which one's better. Unfortunately. Not yet, anyway. Let's go right back at the enemy. If I think these might not be a bad idea to get some experience, but there's so little of them. Let's do it anyway. Yeah. We have a decent infantry not line as well now. Okay, Nama Nagamaki. Oh, it can't be used on horseback. Get. The model experience, not bad. And an upgrade, look at that. Nice. Alright, all right. I didn't even equip it. Let's see. Can it be used on horseback? Yes, it can. Get some. Okay, we do. We want more infantry. Did we lose this yet? Ooh, actually not. Look at that. We're actually managing to hold on to something. And besiege something else as well. I think that's the same army as the one that besieged this. Okay, the Val uh, Valandia stuck this. I think they're besieging this as well. So yeah, even though the Empire is like united and has all the provinces, I think they're gonna get picked away. Slowly but surely. Yeah, their strength is usually around 20k or a bit more, 22k or something like that. So they are losing a little bit because they're constantly at war with other factions, a lot of other factions. Be taking anything, taking anything. So we should be able. I should be able to like figure out if the culture change mod actually works for us or not. I think I saw it been up. That's that it's been updated not long ago. Where did I click over there? 
is being updated. So it should work. Hopefully. Otherwise, it would be a good uh, it would be good if you lost something, so I can actually go back and uh, capture it for myself. Really, really, game. You got the better Yarigi again. What the hell, game? Let's see if you can find some enemies. Not caravans, though. Maybe we can join that siege as well. I'll get there in time. Looks like they're losing troops, so they are. Yeah, they're fighting it. Hmm. Siege, or do I go after this guy behind him? I think we go after the guy behind him. Are like this. This guy has zero tactics, so placing him in a part in a, as a captain ain't gonna do much for us. This is the weapon we need. Look at this thing. Well, this is gonna make the things too easy. <laughs> Unless they block. They are. Actually use uh, makes units actually use their shields. This is gonna be a lot harder to get hit then. Yeah, look at that. Just they just block everything. Could actually just shoot at them.
That doesn't seem like I'm... I, I, did, I do, did create a like shorter character, but not this short. What? Okay, he's gonna just keep blocking. I'm gonna get lanced if I'm not careful. So we're gonna waste all our ammunition at this point. Uh, the fox or cab. Only we right. They lost all their ammunition, so their cab only now, not horse cab. Plus, I added the mod where the shields actually block if you hit them on the back. That's gonna make things more painful as well. versus infantry. If only it could slice through multiple enemies as well, that would be so freaking nice. Let's see how, how well our infantry fares against them. Good. Well, no, maybe. guys as well. Not too bad. Alright, okay, be keeping all the loot for now so we can actually Ooh. There we go. So we can get better shit. And so we can actually, like, uh... There we go. There we go. I'll play it all around. And get our guys leveled up a bit. And shield, I don't think we're gonna be needing any of this. Let's get the horses. And the food. Get some. Oh, like, look at that! Forty-three levels up. So, a couple of these and a couple of those. You are the normal infantry.
Okay, now maybe I can get back in here, join the battle. We just send the troops in since I'm wounded. Only two losses, not bad. Wait a minute. A splintered standard Yumi does more damage than a unsplintered one. What? Speed. This makes makes sense. a whole lot of sense. Accuracy. 98. I might go for this one. Archback of Stack Steppy Arrows. 41. Uh, I don't need that many arrows. Let's actually keep this one as well, just in case. We lock all of these. We can dump prisoners in. Why would we? Yeah, we did lose a couple of troops. Oh, the territory is close enough. We're gonna go pick up some more real fast. And go back in. Then we're close to clan level 2, so we can jo actually join the faction. Sure, let's get ten, 10 of those as well. Actually, since we're here, let's just donate the troops, right? Any troops to the garrison? Alright, let's get this back guy back up here as well. Matrashgaru... How do I get rid of then? Okay, five more. 